temperature was kind to us again today. For a first look at weather, here's KQ2 meteorologist Elizabeth McGiffin. Thank you, Alex. That's exactly right. We had another real, another very beautiful day on tap today. And throwing it over now to a look outdoors, we've got a bit of change on the way. We are going to see those clouds continue to work their way into the area. As we can see from that satellite and radar, those few little green spots, those are some showers starting to come together and push their way into northwest Missouri. But it's not looking like those spotty showers will be enough to slow down those holiday travel plans. I'll have more on that, though, coming up later on in the broadcast. Alex, back over to you at the news desk. Welcome back. We had another gorgeous day out there. Warmed up about 10 degrees above normal, up at 63. Woke up a bit on the warm side as well when we reached that low temperature of 40 degrees. Right now outside, we're starting to see some clouds build into the area. We're currently sitting at a temperature of 54 degrees and then dropping all the way down to those winds. They're coming out of the south a little strong, starting to pick up at 9 miles per hour. Temperatures across the area, 50s for the most part throughout the state, and then starting to dip into some mid-40s on into Kansas. Kearney, Nebraska, though, into some upper 30s, sitting at 39 degrees. Right now, that satellite and radar shows the majority of the action in the countries up into the Pacific Northwest where they're getting some rainfall, thunderstorms, and even a few snow flurries. Down for us here in Northwest Missouri, our main concern are these clouds moving in and then even giving way to a chance for some sprinkles overnight. Those sprinkles are due to a cold front quickly starting to work its way into the area. That cold front's going to be enough to bring in some showers, but not affect that sunshine too much because right behind it we have an area of high pressure, which is going to really be coming into play as we work our way toward Thanksgiving. Here's a closer look at what we can expect in terms of rainfall overnight. Most of those showers and thunderstorms coming and going not seeing or expecting much rather in the way of thunderstorms for northwest Missouri though. Just a few sprinkles here or there, maybe picking up a tenth of an inch in terms of precipitation. Right now though, as we work our way toward those holiday travel weather, the majority of that action once again staying up in the Pacific Northwest, seeing those showers up there even as we work our way toward the Canadian border, seeing some snowfall with that. If you're staying in the Midwest though, especially here in St. Joe, high pressure is going to be that main story, keeping those temperatures very mild for us. Day after Thanksgiving though, we bring in an active jet stream, which for, means that we're going to be seeing some showers up to the north. So if you're headed south to go back home, you're going to have a chance for some showers. But for the most part, for us in northwest Missouri, that just means we're going to see a bit of cooler air start to push its way down to northwest Missouri after Thanksgiving. Now here's a look at your forecast. Overnight, temperatures bottoming out, even warmer than what we saw last night, 44 degrees, scattered showers into the area. Tomorrow morning, we're going to see a few of those spray or stray sprinkles rather in the area, but then quickly giving way to a mostly sunny sky, and then that'll warm temperatures up to about what we saw today into those low to mid 60s, 63 degrees. We'll do it for that temperature tomorrow on into Tuesday. But then as we switch over to Wednesday and Thursday, we're looking at 70s for Wednesday and then upper wow. 60s again for Thanksgiving. 67 on Thanksgiving. So after we stuff ourselves with turkey, in my case, a lot of mashed potatoes and oh, sweet too. potatoes, and go do a few laps outside around the house, right? <laughs> exactly. Good weather to run around outside, maybe play some football, even take a nap outside. It's, it'll be good weather for that. All right. That sounds great. Thanks a lot. All right. So we got nice weather coming up this week. Everybody ought to remember to wear their jackets. Thanks so much for watching St. Joseph. Have a great day.